YouTube, what's good? It's your boy Sneaky Sneaks back with a new video. I hope you guys are having a great day on today. Hope all is well with everybody. All right, today, in today's video, I'm going to share with you guys my latest pickup. I'm very excited about this pickup. And it just came in today. And we're just going to go ahead and get right into it, man. I ain't going to waste no time with it. As you can see by the box, you already know what it is, man. Check that out. The Air Jordan 4 Bread Reimagined. Size 10. You got that uh cement lid, which is normally on the bottom of the box. And your lid is uh usually black. But they uh they swapped it out and gave us that gray cement lid and you got your nike air and red you got that iconic jump man logo with flight at the bottom let's go ahead and get into it man yo i am so happy to have these in my collection, finally. Here's a look. This shoe is fire, bro. I mean, absolute fire. Like, these are dope. I've always wanted the Air Jordan 4 Breads. Um, it's my favorite colorway in a Jordan 4. And I'm just happy to have these, man. These are really nice. You got that uh black Nike Air hang tag instead of the orange that uh comes with the uh the OG pair. And instead of the new buck, you have an all leather upper, which is very dope in my opinion. Really nice leather, man. You got, here's a look at the bottom. You got that Nike on the bottom with your uh, red and, and cement gray. You got a clear air unit. Nice quality on the paint job. The midsole looks really nice, man. You got your cement gray here. These are dope, man. Got your jump man on the tongue. Nike Air on the inside. I'm gonna go ahead and pull out the other shoe real quick. Yeah, these are nice, guys. These are really nice. I got these on the uh, sneakers app when they released on Saturday. I hit on the sneakers app. And I was surprised that it was so easy to get these. Like, these, these were easy to get. Like, I just, you know, I went on the sneakers app and went for my size. And I saw that, that got them, you know, that got them popped up. And I was excited about that, man, because I really wanted these. I slept on these uh, back in 2019 when the uh, the OG New Buck came out. I slept on that pair, man, because I, I was, you know, thinking that they weren't going to sell out as fast as they did. Um, but I actually slept on them the day that they released back in 2019, and I called. Uh, my local uh, local footlockers and, you know, other stores to see if they still had some. And they were sold out everywhere. So, you know, I kind of regret it, you know, sleeping on them back then. And ever since, man, I've, I've been wanting a pair of these. Uh, of course, you know, it's it's the reimagined pair. It's not, you know, the OG pair with the, the new buck. But these look just as good. I still prefer... 
the OG pair, but these are not bad at all. Like you, you can't go wrong with these at all, man. It's still a bread for, and you know, these look really good with the leather. So I'm just, I'm just happy to finally have these in my collection because like I said, this, this is my favorite Jordan 4 colorway of all time. And you know, these shoes are just iconic, man. You know what I'm saying? Michael Jordan, you know, did some, some great things in these shoes, man. Just legendary. Like the shot over Craig Elo, legendary, man. Even that, that 180 spin against the, uh, Detroit, when he uh kind of ran out of bounds and then ran back in and, and caught the ball and, and did that 180 spin, uh, reverse layup, he was rocking these bad boys when he did that, man, against the Pistons. You know, just, it's just some, you know, iconic moments, you know, from MJ rocking these bad boys that make these shoes so iconic. And it's just a dope shoe. Like, you know, this... Jordan 4 bread colorway is hands down one of the one of the most iconic Jordan sneakers of all time, man. Like you can't you can't go wrong with these. Very happy to have these, man. The leather is just really nice. Nice green the leather. Looks like a, a tumbled leather. It just looks nice, man. Really loving these bad boys right here. I think, you know, the Reimagined series has, you know, been really, really good. I, I like some of the ideas that Nike came up with, with the, you know, with this Reimagined series. And I think this particular shoe has got to be one of the best Reimagined Air Jordans that's come out so far. So... You know, salute to Nike. You know, these shoes are really dope, man. I'm very happy to have these. And there are rumors, you know, that the Black Cement 3s are coming back out. They're going to do a, a Black Cement 3 reimagine. So I'm I'm kind of, you know, I'm, I'm anxious to see how those are going to look. But I think these right here, Hands down, in my opinion, might be sneaker of the year. You know, I know it's a reimagine. You know, it's not the OG, but I still feel like this, you know, can definitely be sneaker of the year. Uh, I'm just waiting to see what else they bring out this year. But I'm, I'm really digging these right here, man, and happy to have these in my collection. Uh, but I'm not going to hold you guys too much longer. I just wanted to give you guys my thoughts and opinions on the Air Jordan 4 Bread Reimagines. I really like these shoes. Uh, just so happy to have these, man. I, I wanted these so bad back in 2019. And you know, I was I was kind of, you know, blowed that I, I slept on them. But uh, this is a nice retro. The Air Jordan 4, they first released uh, back in 1989, then they retro for the first time in 1999, then again in 2012, I believe, and then in 2019, and, and now in 2024. So, and then we got this version with the uh, the all leather upper, the all black leather. Really beautiful sneaker, man. You know, shots out to everybody who wanted a pair and was able to get a pair. Uh, these are really nice. But I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and wrap this up. Uh, you guys feel free to leave a comment below and, and tell me what you think of these. And hit the like button if you enjoy the content. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And stay tuned for more videos. We got more videos on the way. Until next time, y'all be blessed. Peace.